Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, we are reading Acts chapter 24. We have three more chapters, and then we are finished with the book of Acts, and we will be moving on to the book of Luke. I know I kind of went out of order with the Gospels, but it's because I already had half notes for Acts done. So I'm like, you know what? We're going to finish it. So there was a small chance that Paul would be set free. So at this time, Paul was in captivity, and the king, I forget the name, blah, 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 I don't remember, um, said he could, but then I think it was not Pilate, somebody else did not want to and wanted to hold him in custody and stuff. So, yeah, some came to him and say that he was kind and did not fight, um, fight what the... Um, council um so somebody came to uh paul and said that he was kind and did not fight what the people were saying about him and all of that so it was him trying to convince them that he wasn't breaking the laws and all that and that he should be set free and all of that but unfortunately paul's persuasion wasn't really good enough so um he did not get released. So he is currently still in custody. Um, so, yeah. Oh, that's who it was. The highest priest did not want Paul to get let go. But, um, but the king did eventually let him go. So, yeah. I know this is very, very short. I know these chapters are very short. It's it's a really hard book for me to understand sometimes, and it's not my favorite book of the Bible, but it's important because it talks about how the church has grown and all of that. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.